in just a moment. We'll have the women's final, and there is your lineup for the women's final. Caroline Trumpeter, Zena Krilova, uh, Emily Hilgatova, and Sophie Ogilvie in the uh, in the final for the women. So I think it's going to be a, a real real battle in the uh, in the women's and the men's final. I think we're going to see some some really interesting racing. Oh, my money is still on Emily Hilgatova. You right there, Eric? Sort of that, you barman. <laughs> I'm back. I'm, 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 I'm convinced the beer is coming. So I'm back on, on commentary. <laughs> you thought the guy in the white shirt was a barman, but it <laughs> just happened to be Jean-Michel Prono, <laughs> <laughs> the most important man in canoe slalom. But that's all right. Okay, here we are, ladies and gentlemen. This is your women's final. All right, this is going to be awesome. What do you think? Uh, I'm, I'm sticking with I'm sticking with Hilga Tova today. I think she's paddling really well. She's fast early, which might give her that early advantage. You did see that she's in the third position. Yes, uh, that, that's going to be more challenging than she's seen before. Uh, Caroline see, has the move, so she's uh, she's proven she could win, and she has made the key passes so far. So I think I think they're going to tangle in the beginning. I think Hilga Tova is not going to get in the, in the front spot, but we'll see. She did have a good start on the semifinals. So she did. She really, really did. Who else do we have? Uh, well, we have uh, Krilova, the Russian, who was very good in the uh, semifinal. She led from start to finish, stayed out of all the trouble, just um, got out there, got out early, and, and never looked like being hit. So and there's Hilga Tova, the 23-year-old. Always happy. Always happy. Well, happy with That's Carolina. awesome. Yeah, it's good. It's very good. Better to be happy. And then, of course, Whoa, Sophie Ogilvie, the barman has arrived. Sophie Ogilvie, who, if she wins today, she will have uh, really earned her medal because she's put in some pretty hard yards for this final. So here we go. Who will hit the water first? That's what it's all about. Are they ready? Go. Oh, and it is Caroline in first. And Hilger Toba misses a stroke, but she's in a good spot. But it looks like it's Krilova, the Russian. It is Krilova. Oh, my gosh. Oh, and it is Oh, look Hilger at that. Hilger in trouble. Hilger Tova's, no, Hilger no, Tova's good. It's Penny, it's, uh, it's uh, not Penny, it's Ogilvy. But Kr it's Krilova again, Krilova is running away with it again. Uh-oh, so Hilger Tova's in third, and, and third and fourth are tight. This upstream, um, Krilova's going to go in. She's going to come out nice. Oh, it looks, looks like our German girl's good. Yes, oh. she's in second. So Caroline's in second. No, wait. Yeah, that's right. So that's right. it's 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 Krilova first, Trumpet is second, okay. Ogilvy third, and Hilgatova fourth at this stage. Okay, so what's going to happen here? It all depends on this hole in the roll. So Krilova, this is a very powerful performance. She's uh, boom, nice, she's and a long way Caroline. in front. Will, will somebody try and Turn. take her out? Good roll there from Ogilvy. Okay, so we're going to watch right now. There's here's where they're going to go for the pass and. Number three is going to take out, try no, to take out number two. Yeah, but Krilova's been left alone. It's, She's going to... Oh, what's going on? Krilova's just oh. been left to, to cruise to the finish. It's it's over. That's a gold medal, a silver medal, and a bronze medal. I don't know who, who got bronze. We got Krilova for first. I think Trumpeter got the silver. Trumpeter for silver. And who was third? I think it was Ogilvy. Let's just wait for confirmation. And Krilova from Russia. That was... She was... She was... That was awesome. So yeah. the... Hilger Tova and Trumpeter got Trumpeter the were tangled in the very beginning, and it was game over along with uh, Hilger Tova, the three of them. Just waiting for confirmation now, but I, here we go. So, uh, yep. Hilger Tova, Trumpeter. Hilger Tova got up for the bronze, and uh, Ogilvy finished outside of the medals. But that was a very, I mean, Krilova, nobody came near her. It's like she had COVID. It was. She was, she was out there on her own. That, well, that start with, let's, I want to see that start again. So Hilger Tova missed one stroke at the start. Um, Caroline looked awesome. I don't know what happened. All of a sudden she, she went from having an amazing, uh, like coming off first, but somehow she, she slipped on her paddle or something happened and had her drop like a hole. Here we go, let's have a look at this. So look at Caroline. She's going to be the first in the water. She's doing great. And Hilger Tova crashes in. Hilger Tova skips and misses a stroke there. But somehow Krilova made uh, got that lead there. I'm not sure how she pulled that off. That was awesome. Trumpet had lost a lot there. She's going up and down in the one spot there. So, yeah. and by that stage Krilova was gone. She was she was on her way to she was on her way to chocolate cake at that stage. It had the race well and truly in her keeping. 
Yeah, the, um, uh, the, what are we seeing there? We were seeing number two. Yeah. Uh, who was, uh, no, not number two, trumpeter, number four. So there's, uh, there's trumpeter now. Right, and she... Interesting that they all went the other side and they just, all went just the left Kroll over to her own devices. Mm-hmm. Wow, okay, that was a great race. So what do you think? Oh, well, uh, I think that uh, I think that, that is a very deserving win for the girl from Russia. Here we go. Xenia, what a race, amazing. You're full of adrenaline. How do you feel? I'm, I'm very happy. Thank you very much. This is first mile. Uh, God in World Cup. Okay, thank you very much. What she said is that this is her first World Cup gold, uh, which it is. That's so awesome. Well done to uh, Senna Kralova. Yeah, that winning the gold. She ran a great race. She ran a great semi-final and then followed up in the final. She didn't. She didn't tangle with the other ladies. She got had clean strokes. The other three ladies had a couple tangling strokes. She took the lead. There was no passing to be had after that. She had enough of the lead. They just couldn't catch her in the upstreams. So she moves to the, uh, the top of the leaderboard now for the World Cup after two very good results. Uh, second last week and a uh, first today. So well done to young Krasina Krolova from Russia. Okay, yeah. some, some kind of random shots here from uh, some of our, our earlier heats. That was a... Um, so that's Krolova there. There's uh, Karina Kunle. I think we're going to see a bit more, um, a bit more bumping and argy bargy going on in the men's final. I, I, I don't know. It all depends. I think um, Pepe has not had to tangle with anybody yet. If, if Pepe gets another good start, so far he's been, he's gone from the starting line to the finish line uninhibited. Yeah. So I, I think my, here's my tip. Uh, I think Stefan Hengst will match it with Pepe at the start. Stefan's very fast as well, early on, so those two but could take each other out. I don't know what number Stefan's ranked, but... Um, two. He's ranked number two. He's the, former, he's the current world champion. Okay, so then he will be right next to Pepe, so yep. we could have some action. I All right. we will. And that but might leave the door open for Joseph Clark to, uh, to sneak through, but... Uh, I mean, people forget, people don't realise this, Pepe Goncalves and Joe Clark are the two guys who took Eric Jackson out. Mm -hmm. in the heats. 